What's going on? This is Gilbert Robinson here. Thank you for watching. I always appreciate it. And you know, um, in this topic, I pretty much want to talk about, you know, um, as far as people go with like begging and, you know, trying to convince people to join your opportunity and all of that, you know what I mean? At the end of the day, you really got to look at how you introduce yourself to the business, you know, with somebody really begging you or convincing you to go in. And, you know, if you can say no to that, then it's like, why should you have to tolerate somebody else doing it? You know, I go, like, I try to convince people who aren't marketing and do marketing. And, you know, I got to explain to them, you know, they're asking me how much have I made so far and why, you know, I did it. How long have I been doing it? Do I get paid weekly? And it's like all these questions are understandable, but it's like, you know, you obviously seen what I've been doing for the past couple of months, almost close to a year. You know, you've seen me working from home, you've seen me going places, you've seen me, you know, connecting with people who are like-minded, and, you know, you still have to ask me, like, what I'm doing, and, you know, how much have I made? I mean, me personally, like, I don't see that as a wrong question, but it's like, you should see opportunity instead of financial security, because at the end of the day, these income results are not typical. Not everyone's going to make the same thing. It's not like a job where, you know, you get your paycheck at the end of the week, and you can go on about your life, like... This is really and truly about building an income that, you know, can help you do anything that you dreamed of. It could help you, you know, change the way you make money and change the way you live life. Because a lot of us, we live paycheck to paycheck because it's stable, you know, it it, it gives us a sense of security, you know. But most of us are still struggling even with paychecks. So it's like, why not be open-minded and just do the opportunity if you see one? And that's any company, not just my company. You know, I respect all people who work from home because... You know, at the end of the day, working from home is an open-minded thing. So the fact that you're even... So technically speaking, we're doing the same thing. We're the same kind of business people. But, you know, people who are who are on the outside looking in, you need to just get in whatever opportunity you see that you feel is right for you. Because at the end of the day, the people who are in it today that haven't quit or given up, you know, they most of them weren't convinced. Most of them weren't... You know, they were introduced to it. You know, they watched videos, but most of them weren't asking stupid questions and you know trying to find a sense of security because an entrepreneur lifestyle is no sense of security you know it's all about what you make out of it and what you really look to do with your opportunity because either two things can happen either you can succeed or fail but if you think success then only success can happen and to me it's like when you ask about financial security and you know are you guaranteed anything you're already looking for failure you know just in case you fail this is what you'll get or just in case you know, things don't work out, this is what you get. It's not like that. So it's like, if you see opportunity, you got to go for it. If you see something that can potentially change your life, you got to go for it and stop waiting around and stop making excuses saying that you're not good with talking to people, you're not good at this, you don't think you'll be good. Like, you got to look at opportunities like this with an open mind saying that, you know what, I'll try my best and I'll do what I can do and, you know, to hope that it will work out. Because, I mean, if you look at it in another way, you might as well not join because you're just going to fail if you're not thinking 100% positive. And, you know, this is just a video of my thoughts, you know, really. I'm just thinking it because I see, you know, and I'm like, no no one in particular, no subs or anything, but I see a lot of people who are, like, struggling on my news feed. And it's like, you know, why live with that option of struggle when there's more options out there? I mean, you're just being closed-minded. You're really just putting yourself in a, a situation that can easily be walked away from. So that's just how I feel about it. I mean, if you see an opportunity, any opportunity, and you feel it's an opportunity that could change your life, just get in. Stop wasting time because, you know, it's a new revolution coming. It's all on the Internet. So it's up to you. Do you want a secure paycheck or do you want an opportunity to make, you know, make six, seven figures in short periods of time or, you know, build an empire where people look up to you and respect you because you believed in them? You know, what do you really want out of life? You know, and think about that. And then when you go asking people who are running these businesses these weird questions, you got to think about why you're asking them and what you really want out of this business. It's either you want a paycheck or you want an income. I mean, they're two different things. I mean, they both they both result with money, but two different things. So think about it. This is Gilbert Robinson. I appreciate you watching the video. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the other side.